This is Ricky Cam number 27, January 1st, 2010. I haven't done a Ricky Cam since June, and uh, it's New Year's Day, and I don't know why I feel hungover and look like crap because I didn't even drink, but I guess that's what you're supposed to feel like on New Year's Day. So excuse me if I look a little bit scary. 2010, there's a lot of things I want this year. And there's a lot of things I want career-wise, and I want to not be so stressed about the things that I was so stressed out about in 2009. I'm going to have fun. More fun in 2010. This Ricky Cam, I'm going to show you a list I've made, the top 35 things I will do in 2010. I show you the list not because I think it's entertaining. Most Ricky Cams, I try to do some goofy stuff or take you to a race or to a concert or have fun. This one is kind of selfish. And I'm just doing it for me so I can look back and look at the things of the goals that I've made for 2010. So real quick, I'm going to go over them. And I suggest you make a list too of top 35 things you will do in 2010. And I've put the list right here. See, 35 things I must do in 2010. And there it is on the refrigerator. And if I don't do them all, I will be pissed. So I'm looking at these things and I'll start it off. Um, the first thing is run 500 miles. I have to run 500 miles this year and I've already run four. So I've got 496 to go. I need to read four books and I like James Patterson novels so I'll probably read a couple of those. Um, I might read the Dexter books. I have to fight in one organized boxing match. And there was talk about the April 3rd one for uh, in Vegas, Hard Rock. That date's been put on, changed so many times. I hope it goes on. It'll be fun. But even if it doesn't, I'm still looking at the possibility of another fight sometime in 2010. I have to fight seven sparring matches. I've actually never really sparred yet. Um, run 1-5K. I've done that before. That's easy. Run a half marathon. I've done that twice. So I have to run one half marathon this year. I have to ride my Harley Davidson 5,000 miles, and uh, I went to Sturgis in 2009, that was 3,000 miles, so if I do that again, that'll, that'll take care of a lot of it. I have to ride my Triumph 1,000 miles, sell 50 items on eBay, attend one NFL game. I have never been to an NFL game, but I leave to Charlotte, North Carolina tomorrow to see the Panthers play the Saints, so I wanted something to check off my list. Um, I have to race in two stock car races, hopefully that'll be easy. Create one new radio show idea. I've got my radio show, Racing Rocks. I have to come up with a whole new concept, and then I have to pitch it to somebody else. Um, I don't know if the show will get picked up. I don't even know if I'm contractually allowed to do another radio show, but maybe it'll be a music thing, maybe a radio version of the ball. Who knows? Um, I kind of miss talk radio sometimes. I also have to write 100 pages of a book that I'm working on called Foot in the Gutter, and in an old blog, I even put some of it in it. And it's... Uh, it's something I want to do. I need to write 10 pages of a book that, I'm work that I want to work on called Suitcase Pimps, which was a reality show that I pitched. And uh, I just have an idea to maybe turn it into, turn it into a, um, like a drama, like a scripted series. But who knows? Everybody in this town's writing stuff. And I hate the people like, I got a pilot, I'm pitching it. But I got, that's what I guess I do, even though I'm like, I'm in this business, but I'm not really in the business. It's weird. Um, I have to make three TV show appearances. That could be in anything, so who knows what that'll be. Uh, write 12 big-ass blogs on MySpace. Sell one style of cat house shirts in a high-end chain. Uh, if you go to cathousehollywood.com, you know Ricky's Private Reserve is my apparel company. I'm making a vintage cat house shirt like we sell now. I would like to see just that style in a... Hey, Gail, what's the high-end places? Like Bloomingdale's? Yeah. Like Bloomingdale's. I want to see a cat house shirt on sale in all the Bloomingdale's. That's just something I thought would be cool. I have to clean RPR, my apparel company, clean the garage. Golf three times. I don't golf, but I got to golf three times. MC two big events. Um, it could be corporate events. I've done stuff for Jack Daniels, many events for Chevrolet, and uh, I like doing them, and I have to do two big ones this year. I don't know what they're going to be. I have to go on five auditions. I hate auditions. I don't necessarily like actors, but I want to work, so I'm going to go on five auditions. I have to write one new pilot for whatever an idea and pitch it to somebody. I'm not going to say, I'm going to create a TV show and it's going to get on the air because who knows if it is, but I got to come up with one idea and then I have to pitch it to somebody. I got to raise five raise $3,000 for charity, take four computer classes, learn 50 Spanish words, 
Um, change the oil on my Triumph. Okay, this sounds really stupid to most of you, but I'm the first to tell you I'm not a wrench and I'm not happy about it. So I have to change the oil on my Triumph by myself. Silly. Film 12 Ricky cams. This one might not be exciting, but it's a Ricky cam, so it takes one off my list. I have to play Call of Duty and win online once. I suck at that game. Okay, this is a stupid one, but it's something to cross off my list. Um, I need to write a new bio. I need to pitch an idea I have of being a spokesperson for a certain company. It's an idea I have. I'm not going to tell you who it is, but it's just this idea of some corporate events I could do. And that's not selling out. It's something that I believe in. Like I was with Chevy for five years because I'm a Chevy guy and I had a blast with them. So I'm thinking of some other stuff I can do. I have to attend five yoga classes. Gail kind of wanted me to do that one. And there are these stairs up Runyon Canyon. I have to make it to the top of the stairs in under 530. That is my list of the 35 things that I need to do in 2010. I suggest you make a list as well. And uh, everybody have a good 2010. And this year is the 20th anniversary that I started Headbangers Ball. And I realized I've been in this business a long time and been doing pretty good in it. And I really do appreciate your support. And I don't mean that in like a, hey, I appreciate your support kind of way. I mean it in a, hey, I appreciate your support kind of way. Could you tell the difference? Bye.